praise the lord hallelujah god bless you so much for always watching the rest here again so let's dive we're going to read the book of joshua chapter 17 verses 1 it says there was also a lot for the tribe of manessa for he was the first born of joseph to wait for michael the first born of manessa the father of gilad because he was a man of war therefore he had gilad and basham there was also a lot for the rest of the children of Manessa by their families, and for the children of Abeza, and for the children of Elek, and for the children of Assyria, and for the children of Sheshem, and for the children of Ipha, and for the children of Sh Shemida. These were the male children of Manessa, the son of Joseph, by their families. All what this tribe is trying to say is that a good man leaves inheritance for his children's children. That's what David has done. Joseph has done, sorry. Joseph let's try for his uh, left possession for his son Manessa and even get to his grandchildren. But Zelophehad, the son of Epha, the son of Gila, the son of Mika, the son of Manessa, had no sons but daughters, and these are the names of his daughters Mela, Noah, Oglad, Mikal, and Taza. That were the names of the daughter of um, the son of Manessa. Like our God is a great God, and He wants us to have generational blessing, not generational curse. What we, are, what we should be passing down to our children are blessings and not curses. Anyway, we have unknowingly or out of ignorance passed different a different thing that Lord has not asked us to pass, like curses or every other thing. Father, Lord God Almighty, by Your mercy, let it be reversed to blessing in the name of Jesus. Have mercy upon us. Let Your mercy speak for each and every one of us, because we all have a foundation. We all have. Where we are coming from in any way we are suffering from what our forefathers have done pilot mercy speak for us today we decree we are free because he that the son of man set free is free indeed he that the lord set free is free indeed hallelujah god bless you so much for always joining share subscribe let the of god go out there if you are still living your life without christ you're on a very long thing you're just walking around without purpose without eternity in mind and that's not good for us. So accept Jesus today and let your life begin to make sense. God bless you.